Hey, did you see this on Bob's channel? When someone in the community needs help, all hands pitch in and we work together. And so we want to try and do that. And we're going to have a kind of a, a bus building party. Mm -hmm. And we're hoping you can come. Remember I told you I was going to start working on the inside of the bus and you might be able to help? Well, here's your chance. Stick around to the end. I'm going to tell you more about it. I made it to the desert. I'm in Ehrenberg. Captain loves it here. I can't even keep up with him when we're in the desert. He wants to explore everything, or I should say he wants to pee on everything. It's really cold and that's why he's wearing his sweater and his coat. My diesel heater broke, so that's a bummer, but otherwise I'm starting to relax. It's been a while, you know. This has been a pretty tense month. The new paint job looks amazing, especially last night in the sunset. And I swear this picture is not Photoshopped. The sky really was that color. This particular spot is not my perfect dream spot, but I pulled in kind of late after swinging into Blythe for groceries and Del Taco. I didn't want to go driving all over the place in the dark because the sun was already going down, so I stopped here. It's fine and it's easy to find, which is good because someone is arriving today and this particular someone is navigationally challenged. Let's just say that. I mean, I'm not saying it behind her back because she'd say it too. I've spent two days in this spot by myself and I don't mind that at all, either the spot or being alone. But yeah, when, um, when my friend arrives, we're gonna move. I have a couple of map pins that Gina sent me and I'm gonna look at those spots. I'm gonna poke around, see if I find anything else that looks interesting. The object of the game is to find a place that's not too hard to get to, but not right in the middle of everything either. Hopefully a spot with a view because there's hopefully gonna be a bunch of people coming. I just want it to be just the right place. My friend should really be here by now. Oh, that's probably her. Hello? Okay. Yeah, you're on the wrong side of the freeway. Um, just cross over, just, you know, go to the other side. There's the bus. Have you ever seen a YouTube channel called Cat and Dogs on Wheels? Well, this is Cat. Those are the dogs. So we blended the pack and they're doing pretty good. Captain thinks he's about RJ's size, so it makes sense that he's tagging along like that. Echo is a little harder to manage, so she's on a leash, but they're all doing pretty well. Hey, hey. <laughs> We did a little scouting after Kat got here and found what we both think is the perfect place. But again, it was late in the day and I still had stuff all over the place outside the bus, so we're gonna move in the morning. Here's the new spot. We're overlooking this, I guess you'd call it a valley. In some places it drops off steeply, in other places it kind of slopes down. The closest neighbor is another boss. He's way over there. I know I have to jump right into the task in front of me, but it's a little overwhelming. I'm starting pulling everything out of the bus, putting it all into tents so that I can organize it and figure out how much storage we need to build. Look, there's my cool sink. See, the sink itself is okay. It's gonna go back in, but the vanity, well, it's a sideboard really, that it was mounted in, got wrecked. So I pulled it out and the big possum belly table too. I had to take it apart and pull that out. And now we're burning it up. It's firewood. Out with the old, in with the new. I love that cabinet. I'm just, I'm just trying to look forward instead of back, you know? Hi, from Ehrenberg. Hi. It's Christmas in the desert. Yes, and it I'm- It sounds like a Bob Hope special, like, <laughs> like the name of a Bob Hope special. Christmas in the desert. Mm -hmm. Kat and I were supposed to meet up in Tucson, but she got COVID. And then when I tried to talk Christmas to her- I said, I didn't feel Christmassy. And here we are. We had similar situations that were keeping us static. And now we are no longer no. static. Now we're free. Static to nomadic. I think that's somebody's channel name though, so now we're probably gonna get sued. 
And it's, it's been sort of a rough road getting here. Oh, this yeah. Shift. Tell me about it. <laughs> you, think, you think your road was rough? <laughs> we have stumbled upon a particularly spectacular spot. Very special spot. And we're not telling you where it is. <laughs> <laughs> well, not unless you want to come help rebuild the bus, and then we will tell you. And you can come camp here, too. If you're in Arizona or you want to come to Arizona, we're going to be working on rebuilding the inside of the bus from the 28th to the 31st right here. It's a great spot, and there are going to be some great people here, and we would love to have you. So if you want to come, email me at watch at maxmini.tv, and I'll send you the directions. If you're a carpenter or a seamstress or a basic mechanic or you want to DJ or cook for us or just hang out, just whether you can make it or not, thank you for being such a big part of what was a truly crazy year for me and i hope you're spending christmas with people and animals you love eating good food and celebrating the end of that crazy year but even if you're even if you're not if you're alone you're not alone because you're here happy everything everyone happy, nope. happy christmas happy hanukkah happy kwanzaa happy i can't say happy solstice because it's not really the solstice but anyway happy everything yeah. And Happy New Year if we don't see you before then. And May 2023 treat us well. My don't even say that because I, I looked at my 2020 video and I was like, 2020 is going to be the greatest year ever. <laughs> <laughs> so don't even, 2023 is going to suck. If we say that, it'll probably be great. Okay. Okay? There you go. Okay. Good night.